What's up guys, I'm Perry, and today we're gonna show you how to set up your WIM remote to your WIM Pro. Now, along with using the WIM app, you can also use the WIM remote to control your WIM Pro. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is get a pair of AAA batteries and plug them into the remote, which we've already done here. After that, you're gonna go into the device tab of your WIM app and go to the settings icon here. You'll see there's a remote tab there, so we're gonna go ahead and click that. So you'll get this prompt here to pair your remote, so we can go ahead and click on that. And now you'll see that the WIM Pro is in the process of pairing the remote, and then this will come up once it's all done. Now if that prompt to pair your remote to your WIM Pro doesn't show up like it did with us, you can hold down the source and the mute button together for about two seconds, and then this will set the remote to the pairing mode. After that, you should get that prompt and finish the setup from there. So let me quickly explain what each button does here on the remote. So we got the standby button here to set the receiver into standby mode. We've got the voice control button here. So if you have your Alexa or Apple HomePod connected to the WIM Pro, you can press this button and then it will wait for your voice command. We've got the volume control with the plus and minus button here to control the volume coming out of the receiver. We got the skip forward or go back buttons here to switch between tracks. And in the middle, we have the pause and play button. We've got the source button here to switch the source that's playing through the WIM Pro. Next to that, we have the mute button to cut the volume from our receiver. And underneath here, we have the preset buttons to activate the presets that we set through our app. So now let me show you how to set up a preset. So say I want this song that I'm playing right now to be one of my presets. I can go to the now playing tab and then you'll see these three dots here. So I'm gonna click on that. And then you'll see we have the preset option right here. So I can click on that. And from there, I can pick any of these slots that I want the song to be. So if I want it to be preset one, I can click on one here. So now I have the song set as preset one. So let's say if I'm playing a completely different song at the moment, and right away I want to switch to that preset, I can go to my remote and press preset one. And then it's going to play that song that I set as preset one. You can also queue up a playlist as one of your presets. And for that, you're going to go through Spotify, search for your playlist, start your playlist by playing the first song there. Then you're going to go to the now playing section of your WIM app and press the three dots. Set it up to any of the empty preset slots here. And then you'll know it's working when the preset is listed as the name of your playlist. And you can also use the other music services that we have available to do this. So for example, if you wanted to use a song from Amazon Music as preset two, you're gonna follow the same exact steps. Go to this three dot button here, go to the preset button and set it to whatever preset you want. So hopefully this showed you guys how easy it is to set up your WIM remote to your WIM Pro. But of course, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to reach out to our customer support team through phone or email. As always, I'm Perry, and we'll see you guys next time.